Hello guys, this is Indian Medico and in this video, we are going to see about perforation of nasal septum. This is a concise presentation for medical students. Nasal septum is the structure that divides the nostrils. In nasal septum perforation, the nasal septum develops a hole or fissure. This is how a patient with perforation of nasal septum presents to you. Now, what are the various causes for perforation of nasal septum? Trauma is an important cause. Trauma can be caused due to submucous resection or due to cauterization of septum done for epistaxis, habitual nose picking or piercings. Perforations can also be due to other pathological conditions like septal abscess, nasal myiasis, rhinolith and other chronic granulomatous diseases. Among chronic granulomatous diseases, lupus, tuberculosis and leprosy cause perforation of the cartilaginous part of the septum. Syphilis causes perforation of the bony part of the septum. Certain drugs and chemicals can also lead to perforation of nasal septum. For example, prolonged use of topical steroid sprays can cause nasal septum perforation. Habitual cocaine usage can also lead to perforation of nasal septum. Chromium plating, dichromate, soda ash and arsenic can also cause perforation. That's the reason people involved in these occupations are more prone to develop nasal septum perforations. Many cases of nasal septum perforations are idiopathic, that is, their cause is unknown. What are the clinical features of nasal septum perforation? In case of small anterior perforations, whistling sound will be heard during inspiration or expiration. In cases of large perforations, there will be development of crusts which obstruct the nose and these crusts cause epistaxis when removed. How do you treat a case of perforation of nasal septum? We have to find out the cause and treat the cause. Small perforation can be closed surgically by plastic flaps. In case of large perforations, we need to keep the nose crust free by alkaline nasal douches or by application of a bland ointment. A thin silastic button that is a button made from silicone rubber can be worn to get relief from symptoms. Thank you.